accessing your responses, you're going to go to your Google form into the edit screen and click on responses. You'll notice that I have 18 responses and if I were to sit here and someone were to fill out this Google form, it would crank up to 19 and I could watch the responses come in live. So you notice under responses it says summary. So as I scroll down, it's going to show me a pie chart for the multiple choice questions. It's going to choose which chart it thinks best summarizes your information. Now I think this is a really cool feature is notice that each chart I can copy. So if I go to slides, I can control V paste and add those charts to a presentation. Now these charts are not linked as the form updates. This is a picture of the chart so it will not update, but it is a nice way to capture the data at a particular moment. So you just go into your Google form, click on the responses tab, find the summary chart that you like, hover over it and get the copy icon and come over to Google Slides where you can paste the chart. And again, this is at a particular moment. It is a picture of the chart, not a live link to the chart. Now if you want individual view, you can come back over to the responses and instead of summary, click individual. And you'll be able to have a drop down list of the email addresses or you can arrow through to find the responses, which one you want. And it's gonna show you what the form looks like when it's completely filled out. If you don't want one of the responses, you can simply come over while you're in individual view and click delete responses.